School for Fashion Design, so we've been in every process of their life that they're doing now, we've been there. So we understand it. We've, we've got yeah, we've got our butts kicked, learned mm -hmm. learned a lot of what not to do, what to do. And it's cool because we're like, oh, okay, do this, can't do that. Oh, how about this? Because we have that experience. Like how and why they did that. And then look at their color choices, fabric mm -hmm. choices. And why did they choose those colors? And why did they choose those fabrics? We want, like, do you want the story behind right. it? And how bad they want it. Because right. we know a really good garment's going to take mm -hmm. a long time if it's just you working on it. If the depending on like the actual design, you can tell who really wants it. My role as fashion writer for NBC, which I love, and um, it's really been cool. I mean, even beyond you know modeling and being with um, Campbell Wagner for so long. Um, I really expanded my contacts even beyond that and got to know so many more um, local designers and just know a lot more about the more organic fashion scene. I'm the corporate concierge for Barney's New York. So in uh, layman's terms, what that basically means is I take care of celebrities and wealthy folks that come in from out of town. I make sure they're in the best restaurants, best hotels, best private clubs. If they want to roll around the town in a Bentley, I'll make sure that happens. In essence, I try to make sure that whoever visits my city, they see the best of the city, and I, I work very hard on that. Um, I, uh, I own um, the Campbell Wagner Runway. Uh, we represent um, uh, runway models um, for fashion shows, for events, for you know everything that really kind of happens in town. Uh, attitude and confidence. I mean, I, 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 I look all the time for the person that is high step in, whether it be male or female. And, and with, if they're walking with a, with a sense of purpose, I always give them the ups and downs. Because I want to see, okay, you're walking like you're owning it. Let's see if you're owning it. And I love people who have the creativeness not to look like someone else. I mean, blow my mind. I would encourage, especially for young designers, collaborations. Team up, like whatever, whoever it is, right. those people you went to school with, those people you know, right. don't don't do it on your own. Don't be convinced. I've got to have a, a one person runway show, or it's or I'm not having it. No. Yeah. Get with your people. Like right. collaborate. Make yourself look totally put together. Right. Does it matter? It doesn't matter if you have the most, you know, as I said, the most expensive, or the coolest thing, or the brand new thing out there, or whatever. Just pull it together, and that's that's my favorite look. Right.